Welcome guys. It's been a while since I made my last video. Probably almost since last summer. But we're back here this summer, 2024. We got a lot in store. I got some new gear. Today I'm fishing with some new gear here at Alamitos Beach. Look, Mikey. These guys over here already caught a fish. I'm gonna go take a look. That's a big bass. Right? Yeah. <laughs> Mind if I take a video? Yeah, yeah, sure. This is his first one. Oh, yeah? Very first one. I can tell you I fish here a lot of hours doing that big around here. Dude. Oh man, I, I didn't know that they were they were running around because I've been casting and using my stick face. These guys get to hang out while they get to play out there. Oh yeah, that's <laughs> nice. Congratulations, young man. <laughs> it's a big bass. All these years I've been fishing, I haven't caught one that big out here. Further off towards the rock, but not by the sand. So today I have a new reel I'm gonna start using this year. The Daiwa Saltis MQ. It's small, small reel, 2500. Along with a new Phoenix M1 rod. Making rookie mistakes here. I brought this. I completely forgot the hooks. How do you mind? Oh. I did not forget it at home. So I'm hookless. Never done that before. You can tell I haven't been fishing in a while because I forgot that. It's like ridiculous. Now I have to go find some hooks somewhere around here. I have to ask somebody for hooks. So I'm over here hookless and uh, that guy with his kid, he's over there with a, uh, he just went in there and I think he has a halibut on right now. Damn, it's the worst feeling in the world right now. I think I just snagged a bat ray. So the guy out there fishing that caught the, the bass with his son gave me two hooks. So hopefully this catch something with this. So he has a YouTube channel, I believe, Vivid Snares. I'm gonna look it up. But it might, it might have saved my day. At least I get to try out my new rod. A lot more people are coming out since the summertime, so I have limited space to fish it now. Let's see what happens. Thank you very much. All right, my first cast with this, this rod. So finally gonna go out there and cast with it. I didn't even bring my proper strap to strap it on my chest. I gotta hold it around so if I catch a fish, I'm not, you're not gonna see the fight, just the results. What a day. So I don't really like fishing with braid and this is one of the reasons why. For my mono is and the braid connect. I don't know what happened there. It just got tangled up. This is why I like using mono on my light, my light stuff. Cause I don't know. I'm gonna get that out. I don't even know how it got like that. What a day. So, so far this rear rod and reel is pretty smooth. Only thing I regret is putting braid in here. So first day back, this rod and reel worked pretty good. The braid cast pretty far, so it was a nice setup. I'm gonna try again tomorrow to see what we can do in another place. Right, guys, we're over here at the Long Beach Pier. We're gonna fish on the sand. Now I used to pay for parking, not the machine, but now I just use the app, it's way more convenient. You know, update the information, just put in the zone, you first get the app, then you put the zone or whatever parking you're at, just put how much time you want, and you can add more time from your phone. 
so I don't know why I haven't done that before but I'm gonna start doing that from now on here we are going down to our spot to the left of Belmont here there's a like a little lifeguard tournament or something kids are jumping off the pier swimming down to to the beach so we're not going this way we're going to the right and there's a spot over there where I have caught a lot of fish at No, we're going all the way down. Yeah. Further down. What? All the way? Yes. First cast for bait. Let's see what we catch with this. The beach is pretty empty today because it's cloudy. Cold ish, but not really cold. Overcast, I like this weather. Usually like using these three inch to catch a lot of fish. But I'm going big today. Big old six inch, six inch one, one for the big halibut. With this big bait, catch some halibuts. I uh, hope they're here today. In one of my videos years ago, you see me catch a whole bunch of fish down here. Let's see if it's still this good. So I've been getting two pulls. Kind of seems like maybe a croaker, some other fish. Because halibuts on the drop shot, I hardly ever miss. They swallow it. So something is hitting my bait, which is good. Good sign. Go on to them. Got one. Uh, feels like one. Feels like a little one. We found the halibut hole. Hoorah! Oh yeah. Feels good. This is around the area where I was catching them. So it feels good to catch them. Please remember if you watch my videos, I don't even need to touch them. Just turn the hook over. Check it off. That way you don't even need to put your hands on them and mess them up. Look at that, he took the tail off. I'm hungry I guess. I hopefully I found the spot. Got a nice one. I got some it's got some weight in it. Oh yeah. Got a little bit of weight to it. Probably not legal, but nevertheless. Ooh, 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 yeah. Let's do this. You see it over there? Come on, baby. I just want to see you. The camera wants to see you. What are you? Oh, it's a croaker. It's a big fat croaker. <laughs> Man, fat guy. Look at that fat guy. I've been catching big ones this year. Big croakers. Man. 13 inch. I went on the on this one. Root. Look. Look at what we caught here. Starfish. Oh my goodness. How did it get to the top hook? I have no idea. Let me see the top hook. Do you think it must? Let me 
Give me water, you need to Load breathe. up in, yeah. Daddy, Put him in my Don't bring it back. Don't bring it back. Put him in. Put him with the fish. Yeah, it's gonna be so fun. Yeah. Oh, those are stuff which I'm gonna eat them. They're gonna eat. They're gonna eat. <laughs> I was gonna say they're gonna eat each other. I'll be You're such a cop. Well, this weather has turned pretty bad. My kids are out here dying. When I come to the beach now, they're over here wanting to go home. Man, it was just getting good out here. Got a halibut, a croaker, a starfish. Things are heating up. Man, but that looks like I'm gonna have to go home. These kids are dying. Let's see what they want. What? You want to go home? Yes. Why? Well, let's go home, little girl. Fishing was just getting good. All right, grab your stuff. Let's go. Well, it sucks, but I gotta go home. See you guys.